Hey up, if you're thinking about getting Forrester, this is the video for you. Um, you need to head to my website, which is linked below, um, where you can read all about Forrester. You can watch the little intro video. You can read what's currently included in Forrester. Uh, and also check your computer meets the minimum system requirements. Forest is not really a very demanding program. So um, if you have a machine from the last couple of years that meets the minimum specs, um, it will probably work. You don't need the, the latest blazing hardware, but it will work perfectly fine on, an, on a brand new M1 Mac. In fact, it works great on those machines. So Forrester runs within the Max 8 software. You need Max 8.1.10 or later. If you're an Ableton Live user, there's a good chance that you already have a copy of Max that meets the requirements. If not, or you're not sure, just download the latest version of Max. It's not gonna hurt anything. Max operates on this kind of 30 day trial and afterwards it runs in demo mode or it runs in kind of save disabled mode. None of this makes any difference to Forrester. Forrester just continues to work. Um, so you don't need to worry about that. You don't need to purchase Max. There are two prices for Forrester. If you are earning a decent wage and you can afford it, £40 is the price I would recommend. And if you don't have a job or you're a student or £40 just seems like too much money, then I understand. And you can pay £20. You make the decision, do what you think is right. Uh, the price um, is currently a kind of pre-release version. So the price will go up when we get to version one, which should be around January 2022. A small number of users have not been taken to the download page when they when making their PayPal purchase. Um, this is something that I've tried to address and PayPal, it just seems to be a PayPal issue. If it happens to you, don't worry, just email me at this address and I'll sort you out as soon as possible. Also, thanks to the way PayPal doesn't really work, uh, the donate button doesn't seem to work in Russia or Japan. Um, so again, just mail me at this address and I'll sort you out. Just let me know if you want waged or the unwaged price and I'll send you an invoice and we can sort it out that way. If you want to buy it, you just click on the link. So I clicked on the £40 waged link. Um, you can add some money to offset the cost of processing fees or you don't have to, it's up to you. Do what you can afford. Donate with PayPal or donate with a card. So you choose which you want to do. So you just press donate and then the whole thing will go through. Like I say, if you have a problem, if you just send me an, send me an email and I will sort you out as soon as possible. Um, if you need to get Max, then click on this link and it mysteriously knows which operating system you're using and you can just click on the green square to download Max. Once that's downloaded, just follow the instructions to install Max. Once you've paid for Forrester, then download it and you get a zip file, which you can just unzip. I'm going to be tidy and move that to the bin. Inside there's a manual, so have a read of that. It's very incomplete at the moment, I'm afraid, but I am slowly getting through. Um, there's information about setting up your audio, which I'm probably going to run through that with you now. There's a little bit about loading your own sounds. There's three of the generators documented, but I'm going to do all of them. There's information about the MIDI implementation, which might be useful if you want to run Forrester from a MIDI controller. 